at Jasper Garden. Uh, the work is going on, uh, the preparation of the office uh, for Jasper Garden at Akara, Isukwato, in Abia State Local Government. As you can see, the workers, uh, they are doing their work, and uh, we hope we will continue the work um, like this uh, until we see what we can achieve uh, before uh, I will leave back to my base, Hamburg. So this is it. Uh, the foundation um, have been carried on. And like I said before, the preparation of the office. Yeah. At Akara. Isukwata. Local government area. Yeah, this is it. Yeah. So, I move a little bit close so you people can see how you guys, I'll show you guys how the workers are doing. Um, they are doing fine. Yes, is it? You see. Later, I would like to ask the engineer what he intends to do here. Engineer, uh, so I would like to ask you later. You have a little bit of time. Um, like you to talk with my friends um, exactly what you intend to do here. <laughs> How the office is going here? We are the only thing to let the office stay. Here is the office, if I will understand you right, like you explained uh, before. Okay, um, if I'm to explain to you, this is the, um, uh, taking the initial approach. Here is the uh, entrance uh, to the. Um... Let's move forward and see what you did already at the, at the beginning, where the erosion uh, was disturbing. The problem we have, we had an issue of erosion at the front of the uh, the Jasper Garden office. Um, this is it. Uh, he did actually we are a great having, job. Uh, we are having a, a ground erosion. Yeah. Which we decided to give uh, a very uh, good attention in terms of controlling it so that uh, it doesn't repeat itself. Uh, the work itself has kept a normal procedure uh, in order to control it for unforeseen and to stop the reoccurrence. This is uh, what we call a uh, stone pitching. And the, the stone you said pitching, stone pitching. Stone pitching, and it was uh, adequately taken care of. So, in terms of work, everything. Let's go, let's walk uh, uh, through what you did uh, here. And uh, it was really danger. I mean, I mean, before you did this, you know how deep uh, the erosion have already do the crazy work. So, but now it's looking fine. We can march on it uh, without like, having. Like before, this place is, uh, is unaccessible. Uh, yeah. No one can imagine uh, to endanger his or her life uh, coming down here. But now taking a look at it, it has uh, been uh, taking a very good uh, measure in order to curtail it. Uh, we really did uh, a very uh, good uh, magnitude of work in order to stop uh, the gully erosion that won't erode the entrance uh, to the site, uh, to be precise. Now this very place uh, mm -hmm. is where we want to also give another attention so that we'll be able to uh, put a stop to quench the erosion that will try to destroy the site in question so that uh, it will not be a threat to human life. Yeah. That is it. It's looking fine already. I'm not afraid anymore. You, initial time was like, wow, what one can see sort of, I mean, nightmare uh, when how deep the erosion already scattered uh, the place. But now, yeah, you, as you people can see, we're already on it, That's marching. Nice. So it's almost at end. This is already the finishing touch of the work. 
Uh, so let's turn back and see. Uh, maybe let me ask um, um, him that the office what he intend to do uh, at the office side uh, because the work is going on today. The foundation having lay, and uh, the work workers are doing their great job. So let's go a little bit close to the office side and see. Look around the environment. Um, that is around the environment. How does it look in at Akara? Here, Abia State. Akara, Ahaba, Imeni, in Abia State, Nigeria. Yeah, like I stated, uh, Abilishi. Uh, these yeah. are entrance to the office. Mm. Um, we have our compound and the materials, everything uh, has been ad adequately brought to site. And the work has, uh, has begun. Um, today we are able to do blinding as well as our foundation footing. You know, blinding, you call it? Uh, yeah, blinding. Oh, right. uh, it's an approach. You know, in, in building industry, everything goes according to its normal state. Uh, you take it step by step, line by line, in order to actualize it. So the blinding itself, I was uh, taking uh, a very good uh, ratio, ratio one to three, in order to have uh, a very good uh, uh, building structure. Uh, you know, in Nigeria here, what really faces is a building collapse and uh, most times are uh, the lapidated building. So those things have been taken into measure so that uh, it doesn't uh, bring a threat to human life or endangered one's life. You're so right. those measures is what we must put in place in order to make sure that uh, we really have uh, a very good uh, edifice, uh, so to say. So as it is now, we are almost done uh, with the blinding of uh, the uh, foundation footing. The, the base, everything has been adequately created, which we have uh, a foot and uh, three, uh, 3 3.5 millimeters in order to have a very good uh, foundation footing. Uh, all the same, uh, we have uh, a very good uh, column base that will help to assist the reinforcement of the load that are to be uh, given to, to to the upper upper floor. So by by so doing, the load are going to be uniformly distributed. So after which we will have to do our and that this is provided so far. So that is the level of the work for now. And uh, workers, my workers, everybody is on ground in order to accomplish it. There's your workers, ne? Yeah. Okay. Let's see what that what is man doing there? It's like a uh, iron bender or what? Iron fitter. Iron fitter. Okay. Fitter. So he has a uh, taken a measurement uh, of uh, baskets and uh, probably the starter bars, mm -hmm. which we want to use uh, for for the reinforcement of the mm -hmm. building, so to say. Mm -hmm. Hello, we're well done. Hi, we're well done. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, and what do you intend to do the other side um, at the end? I okay, see. Uh, we, we want to have our, our magazine uh, after the office, everything had been erected in order to at least allow us to have an easy flow of the environment that we should be utilized for one or two businesses. Uh, you know, this place uh, is uh, quite a lucrative in nature, which we yeah. will make sure that we utilize it mm -hmm. in order to at least uh, a kind of waste our spaces. Yeah. So each space here matters. Each space here is really, really important. So we make sure we maximize the space in order to achieve our aim. You're right. Uh, I like your, yeah, the plan. <laughs> the strategy is, uh, I mean, it's really, really encouraging. <laughs> All the wow. same, this is uh, just an uh, initial approach. Mm. We, we make sure that uh, we shock people. Yeah. We shock people in terms of uh, work. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe people that know here, uh, they come here next, uh, let's say next two, three years, when you are unable to identify the, the place because we are going to give you the first lift. Mm -hmm. uh, 
so it's going to be a, a very good uh, there's something uh, I see I usually see another place when the work is going on um, I say shaping and uh, what you people call gravel is a mixture it's I mean I don't know I mean it, it looking I mean solid I mean you know um, I mean how do you come to the idea okay the idea is just to have a very good uh, foundation footing in line with uh, a concrete mixing ratio like a secret abin issue so on this basis uh, we use our uh, chipping which is a uh, 4mm and uh, that of uh, uh, stone uh, that stone anyway you know we have been encouraged sometimes when we go for uh, architectural colloquium to make some use of our local materials in order to do what to expedite the work but then those local materials must be of standard that will stand the, uh, the, the structure mm -hmm. now if you take a look at the concrete which is to be torn by uh, one of my workers so the the size of the stone is bigger to that of chipping uh, in in metric we we call it a uh, six uh, six mm but uh, in imperial it is a three quarter uh, yeah. So that is it. So okay. when you turn it, it, ha it used to give you a very uh, concrete mixing ratio and the, the, the solidity. Part yeah. of it. Okay. Wow. Um. All right. Like you say, what about the outside? The it's uh, finishing. Uh, uh, what do you call it? The uh, bridge or the gutter? Stone pitching. Stone pitching. Yeah. Uh, so I'm sorry about that. Uh, some pitching, like you said. Uh, will the work um, continue? Are you sure you're gonna finish that tonight? Of course. The work. No, 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 no. The work is not going to uh, continue today. It's tomorrow. I want tomorrow. To, to channel all our energy today to make sure we have uh, a good result. Uh, predominantly on the. You mean here, this yes, side? Okay. Yes, on, the, on, on the new uh, office being excavated. Yeah. Yesterday and today we've already finished on our blinding. After okay. which now we want to do a little forming in order to expedite our work against our tomorrow. Okay. All right. Uh, thanks a lot. And we keep doing this tomorrow and next and see, um, I mean, the plan, how it's, certainly, I mean, certainly it's going to be uh, going. Uh, like you promised, uh, tomorrow will be more okay. since we, I mean, the block settings will start yes. tomorrow, we commence tomorrow. We start as long as we have a uh, iron fitter, uh, prepared those basket and the starter bars. So by so doing, everything mm -hmm. we have to commence without any delay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thanks a lot. Uh, you, my pleasure. <laughs>